Hi everyone, I have mail and I have gifts to give out, so let's get to it. One from Kenya that says, Dear Pika, hey. So I know it doesn't seem like it, but my mom really respects you for some reason. Not that you're not worthy of respect. I just mean she can't bring herself to respect her own daughter. But she's totally cool for confiding in a stranger? Whatever. If you could see me, I need some help with something that has to do with my mom. Oh. Okay, Kenyatta. Ziki. Oh. Of course, all the lucky coins. Say hi to some people first, though. To see my latest work of art. Ika, your visit is a welcome break in the solitude that is my lonely existence. Mm -hmm. Do you like my latest collection? I was inspired by the color of autumn leaves. It's strange how sometimes death can be just as captivating as life. Um, I don't have anything for you. Oops. Try not to be a stranger. Okay, who was I supposed to give a single back to? And... The... I'll go with Eloisa and... No? Kenyatta! Oh, oh, she has something for me. Okay, let's go find Kenyatta. Oh wait, rest, rest before I lose you. Come to hear me talk? Hmm... Nope. <laughs> that face. <laughs> hey, Ani. I am so glad to see you. Uh, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's true. May your gardens be weed free. Asian. Let me say hi to Zaki already. Did we not? Arf? Arf, 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 arf. Arf? You've got a surprise for me. Buff, buff. I got chapa fur. <laughs> that's great. Great little one. Okay, where's your? Oh, that's in. There we go. Make sure somebody back. Um, and let's go talk to the other person. Kenya is in here. Nice. nice. Mom's in a bad mood today. I'd steer clear. I got your letter about Eshe. Cool. You know what's not cool? The way my mom has been acting ever since she got this letter from my aunt in Bahari. Last night she lost it because we used the pasta bowls for soup. Whatever the letter said, it freaked her out. And you know how she is. She'll just try to take care of all of this herself. I know you guys are tight. So I was hoping you'd go to her room and find the letter. Oh. Me and dad get along a lot better than me and mom. He's not as obsessed as my mom is about my path. And he, you know, actually treats me like a person. It's nice. Just wish he wasn't such a pushover with mom. I could use someone on my side. How do I get a key to Eshe's room? You could always try asking her for it, you know. If that doesn't work, then try my dad. Hope you don't get murdered. Yeah, hopefully I don't get murdered. Thanks. <laughs> How do you do? Eloisa, you, you have... Yes. Oh. Smells like a Cali. Interesting. Cleary, I remember you like how-to books. I just got some new instruction manuals on juggling. I think you might tickle your fancy. When Eloisa and I were little, we would spend hours at the beach. When she found a green pearl, she always said it was good luck. A sign our parents were looking out for us beyond the veil. There are beautiful stories written in the sky if you know how to look for them. If not, you should check out some of the books I have on constellations. Remember, huh. She would like a green pearl. Interesting. And currently, oysters are in a shortage. Okay, let's try Kenley first. Because I have the feeling he might be easier to persuade the key from. Oh dear, now where did my sandwich go? Can I have a key to your room? Certainly. Can I ask you why you want it? I have the gift for our Eshe. Oh, and you want to put it in there as a surprise. What a great idea. Here's the key, but I would make sure Eshe likes your present before giving it to her. You don't want to know how she gets when she give you give her something she hates. Oh, the day is drawing to a close and feels like I've accomplished nothing today. Maybe because I could feel Eshe looking over my shoulder the entire day. Oh. Okay. Ashura, I have your... Stickleback. 
Say, I was thinking you'd be too busy setting up to say hello. Why does he keep saying that? Do you know how this room used to be a sword? Yes, I repurposed what was once an instrument of war to be an instrument of service. I keep it around to remind myself even the most specifically built tool can find a new use. Ah, and here's a stickleback. What a delicious looking catch. I've been feeling my tummy rumble all day. I don't think it could hurt to stop for a little snack break, do you? Spokahasian already, Kanizaki, Zifu, oh, chain. Welcome, Phoenix's child. That would chain tonight. I'm keeping an eye out for bright rooms. They make a tea that's very helpful for meditation. Ooh. I give you bright room. And now we go to a look at Ashe's room for the very first time. We're going to check out Ashe's room. Um. This is exciting. I don't need to talk to Ashe. I just go straight to her room at this point. This one. Nope, that's Kenya's room. Ashe's room. Read the letter. Eshe. The news I have heard of late concerning the humans in your village is monumental, to say the least. I trusted you and Kenley to run a quaint suburban hamlet. I didn't expect you to have to bear the burden of being a diplomat to an entire race of newcomers, all on your own delicate little shoulders. My dear wife suggested that perhaps I should stop by in the coming weeks and we can have a little chat about the future of Kalima Village. And who should be running things over there? Yours as always, Duchess Kenyara Bahari. Oh. Um. We don't want a change of hands, do we? Ooh. Everything's so fancy in here. There's a book. Oh, I can't read it. More stuff. There's a book. There's more books. Wow. This room is huge. I wonder if Kenya's... Kenyatta's room's as big as this can't go out into the balcony cool we'll go to Kenyatta it's a huge house I wonder how Ashley's feeling. Because if I have seen a letter like that, I'd be like, I don't want to lose power. Given her personality, of course. Hi, I guess. I read the letter, and what did it say? Um, it sounds like your aunt is worried about your mom's management skills. Crap. The only thing that makes my mom happy is running this place. I know me and my mom have differences, but I don't want to see her miserable, and neither do you trust me. If you really are her friend, you'll keep an eye on her and tell me how she's doing, okay? We cannot let this go the wrong way. If you think my mom's bad, just wait until you meet my aunt. I doubt Kilima will be standing after. We'll still be standing after. Ooh. Okay, we'll go we'll go find Ashe now. First leave scary. I don't know you. Um Ashe. Okay. Unlike most people, I cannot afford to dawdle for too long. I've been in a constant state of war with the Duchess Force, as long as I can remember. The one that started well before I married her idiot of a brother. Okay. I think she's on the same quest. But for now, I guess that's all for it. Right? Um, we have home. I have mail? Ashe Eloisa. Dear Pika, I woke up to a pleasant surprise on my doorstep this morning. A beautifully wrapped delivery box from my bakery. From my favorite bakery in Mahari City, I ended up getting an extra serving of their delightful cakes and thought you would like it. In my opinion, it's best enjoyed with a cup of spice sprout tea, preferably in an outdoor pavilion with a view of the water. Perhaps you can find a suitable spot near your home. Thank you. Ashe, 